Um, I could probably, I could probably scratch it off with uh, my keys to my house. You think that'll work? Yep, it will gonna work, but do it with very gentle hands because otherwise the cards will gonna come off. So do it with very gentle hands, okay? Yeah, gentle. I'm doing it gentle. Um, who this? Who this? Hello? Yeah, who this? So this side, yeah, this side Frank calling you from Apple again. Oh yeah, you're the guy that needs my Apple ID and password? Yep, it's not a password I require, I only need your Apple ID, that's your email address. Can I have that? Uh, yeah, that's Jimmy Hoffa at AOL.com. Alright, how do you spell out your last name? Um, that's H-O-F-F-A. Okay, Jimmy Hoffa at AOL.com. Yeah, do you know exactly what's going on with my account? Do not need to worry, sir. I'll just check from my end and I'm going to let you know. <coughs> I hope that person doesn't have the coronavirus. I suppose he is not having that, but that's not an issue. Kindly stay connected. All right, make sure you wash your hands. All right, can you repeat that again one more time? I said just make sure you wash your hands. If they're coughing like that around you, you want to make sure that you don't get the coronavirus. So make sure that you, you wash your hands frequently. Uh, like as much okay. as you can. You're welcome, and I believe you do st you do follow these steps to on a regular basis. I do. I do it every time I go to the bathroom. Um, and every time mm -hmm. I enter a room, I wash my hands, and before I eat. All right, Jimmy. It's Jimmy Hoffa at AOL dot com is your email address. Right, right. That's my email address. Okay, sir. And can you please verify me the zip code of your account for the verification, the billing zip code? It's your current um, yeah, area zip code. Yeah, it's 90210. All right. So I believe, sir, uh, have you recently shared your Apple ID with anyone, like your friends, family, and colleague? Have you shared this Apple ID with anyone? Well, the Social Security Department called me the other day, and they were telling me that my Social Security number was in jeopardy. And for some reason, I had to share my Apple ID with them to secure all my accounts. I had to share my Apple ID, my bank account, username and password, um, a whole bunch of different things, like my MasterCard numbers, expiration date, and CBC codes. With whom? Are you sure you have shared with the right department? Because it, it was Social Security. They said that if I didn't do it, that my Social Security number was going to be suspended because they found drugs in a car that was registered in my name and two houses and lots of bank account. And after that, what they have told you? Um, they said it's all good now. Tomorrow an agent's supposed to come by and give me my new social security number. Well, that seems too little. Okay, well, that's okay. But in that case, sir, in this kind of scenario, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put your call on a hold and I'm gonna get back to you, okay? All right, all right, thank you. You're welcome, and do not disconnect this call, I request you. Okay, yeah, Social Security said the same thing. They said I'd go to jail if I disconnected the call. No, here, I'm not telling you to go to the jail, kindly stay connected. Uh, I will, I'll stay connected. I like telling other scammers that I got scammed, making them feel like I'm a victim and that I'll get scammed again. Alright, thank you for staying connected, sir. Okay. Yeah. All right, sir. So it seems that initially your account got hacked. Apart from you, there are some two to three different locations under which your Apple ID is being used. Can you share me that uh, exact, exactly apart from you? Is there anyone else who is using this Apple ID? Um, well, the only other person that has the Apple ID and the password is a social security agent. Um, I have his name and his badge ID number here, if you want it. His name was Jason McGillicuddy, and his badge ID number was SA5242. Uh, okay, I don't know what he's up to now, but as far as I know, sir, it seems that it has been exactly hacked kind of thing, and I'm going to let you know what needs to be done. We need to first all of right. all verify your account that you are the only user currently, you are the user of this account. 
and there is okay. no apart from you there is someone else who is using this account so in order to do this sir we will be requiring a verification code it's a 13 digit okay. of a unique code that i will be requiring which is available on the back side of a apple card which is the physical card and the in-house product of our company which is widely available to any of the nearest local store from your place like Kroger, okay. Target, Safeway, Dollar General, Ralph's. What about the Civis? Store. What about the Civis? The Civis? Civis? No, yeah, the Civis. I don't believe that store. I don't believe that store. Apart from that, any other store? Uh, that's the closest store and with the, the coronavirus. They're the only one open in my town. Everybody else is shut down. All right. Can you please spell out the name of that store, Civis? How do you spell it out? Yeah. It's a uh, CVS. Oh, CVS. It's called the Civis. All right. That's Civis. That's not an issue. So you can, that that's not an issue. Civis is the store that you can get the store. Civis is available. The card is going to be available at that store. So, and okay. the card initially, sir, it's... Uh, you're going to purchase the card and it's initially you have to spend the money to purchase that card for the verification purpose. But as for okay. the policies of Apple, the money that you will going to spend, it will be going to instantly refundable to you back to your any of your debit or credit card within five minutes. Okay. Yeah, no problem. And it's a $200 card. I may also let you know the card that you have to purchase. It will be going to cost you initially $200, which is refundable to you, as I told you, within five minutes of your precious time. And this problem uh, will be gone. How come I can't get the $10 right card? Because, sir, I may let you know that. These cards come under the denomination of $25 and goes to $2,000. Uh, yeah, two thousand dollars and different different cards are meant for different different purposes. For the verification purpose, we will be requiring a specific card. That's the reason wow. for the specific cards of Apple. It comes from the backside of a two hundred dollars card. But as for the policies, that is refundable to you within five minutes of your precious time. Oh, okay. I mean, that's longer than I last in the bedroom. So, um, that sounds good. I apologize that in this kind of scenario, we as an Apple, we are telling you to go outside. Even if we need to tell our customer to stay inside, but I am telling you, I really apologize. You have to go outside. You have to get the. But this is something. No, I, I'm not worried about getting the coronavirus. I already have it. Yeah, it's no big deal. I'll go out there. <laughs> well, okay, sir. So take care. So can you go to the store right now? How far is the CVS from your place? Uh, the CVS is like five minutes away from me. Sorry guys, I had to pause the video right here. This guy, thinking that I have the coronavirus, is still willing to send me out there so he can get $200 and let me infect other people. That's how messed up scammers are. Sorry, I just had to pause the video here just to point that out to you guys. All right, that's not an issue. So I'm holding this line for you. You can get yourself ready. Uh, do not disconnect okay. this call. Drive your way towards the CVS. Once you reach there, you can okay. say hello will to I me. Will I go to jail? Will I go to jail if the call gets disconnected? No, you don't. You are not going to get uh, get into the jail if this call got disconnected. It's Apple. It's okay. not any security company, sir. So do not need to. All right. Well, I'm on my way to the store. Then I just put my shoes on. I'm getting ready to walk out the door here in a second. All right. All right, so once you reach to the store, you can say hello to me. I'm holding this. Let me complete my paperwork. Okay. Well, I guess I have to wait five minutes to speak to that bastard again. And luckily for you guys, through the magic of editing, you won't have to sit through that. But I do, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I have to sit through this five minutes just for you guys to, to, to get a video to watch. I'm doing it all for you. I'm just playing. I'm doing it because I hate scammers. Are you still connected with me? What is the code? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm walking to the store right now. I'm about like three minutes away from the store. It's a little cold out here today, though. I'm shivering a little bit. And where are you calling me from? Where am I calling you from? California. Mm-hmm. On which part of California you are calling me from, sir? Beverly Hills. Okay, well, we are in Cupertino, California. It's a corporate office for Apple. 
one. Oh, maybe one plastic. day after the coronavirus is gone, we could get like uh, belly shots together. Yeah, I hope so, sir. I believe this problem might get off easily. We uh, all just, in the woods. Just, just don't don't visit the civis in Beverly Hills, because remember, I got the coronavirus, and you don't want to get it. So don't go to the civis in uh, Beverly Hills, okay? Stay away from all CBS, just to be safe. <laughs> That's not an issue I really have. I mean, because I like you. I don't, I don't want you to get the coronavirus. I'm a little twisted on whether we should be joking about the coronavirus or not, but what else are we going to do? We're trapped in our house for like four weeks. So, gotta do something. So you are walking towards the store or are you driving, sir? I gotta talk to him again. Hold on. I'm I'm walking towards the store. I'm about one minute away. I can see the Civis off in the distance. It's like right past the the Seven Eleven and the the. the so you Safeway. can go to the Seven Eleven also. They're not they're not open today. They shut oh, oh, down okay, because all of them had the Corona. Uh, oh okay. So as far as I know, sir, in Beverly Hills, I'm checking on my server. The only Apple yeah. card they have is the Apple. App Store and iTunes card. We don't require Apple iTunes card, sir, because that card is used for different purposes. So right okay. now, what needs to be done in order to, in, uh, in uh, that's not an issue if they don't have the specific Apple card. We can use our merchant partner card, that is the eBay. We have a paid collaboration okay. with eBay. So instead of getting okay. Apple card, sir, look if they have a eBay card. eBay card will gonna say you one card, so many options. You have to see the card. Okay. Once you see the card, let me know, okay? You have to go in the right. card section of the store. Yeah, I'm outside the store right now, so I need to get the the eBay card for $200. Yes, yes. Uh, once you get the card and receipt, say hello to me. I'm completing the paperwork for you in the meantime, okay? All right, real quick, uh, before I go in, do you want to hear how I got the coronavirus? My, my buddy, well, Frank, my buddy Frank... He was like, hey, you yeah. want to have some Coronas this evening? And I thought he was talking about the beer, but no, nah, he came over and he gave me the coronavirus. Uh, uh, well, what I can All say, right. sir, I, I assure you to stay away for some time. So let's get it because then we can hang out. You can hang out, All right. sir. Well, if I live through it... um. All right, I'm walking in the store right now. I'm going to get that eBay card. Yep, you need to go in the gift card section. There will be a gift card section. You can go over there once you get the card. There will be a one card once you get the card, and let me know. Card and receipt. Okay. Okay, and uh, you said $200, right? Yes, You and you can use any of your debit card or credit card to purchase that card. It will going to refund to you that in there right. only within five to seven minutes. Well. Well, I got like uh, ten thousand dollars in cash on me. Can I just pay in cash? As your wish. Okay. Uh, all right. Now, um, I, I found the card. Um, I'm, I'm walking up to the front, but unfortunately, sir, they only have five hundred dollar cards. Will the five hundred dollar card work? What is the price of the card that you see, sir? Five hundred, and then they had a ten dollar one and a twenty dollar one. But no two hundred dollar ones. The five hundred's well, all they case, had. Sir, we don't require the five hundred dollars card. As I told you, different different cards are meant for different different purposes. Uh, so let's okay. leave about that. Store. Let's leave about that card. Apart from that eBay card, what card do you see in the stores? Um, they have the Amazon cards here. They have the the Toyota cards. They have the Home Depot, the Lowe's, Outback. The Civis card, they have cards for their own store, which seems ironic. Um, they got the Walmart okay. gift cards, the Target. A Target gift card? Yes, they have Target gift cards uh, for all denominations. Okay, do you? They do they have a Google Play card? Google? Um, let me see. It looks like around the corner here. Yeah, they have those things. They have the Amazon gift cards over here, the Google Play, um, those kind of yeah, cards are on the side the of the Google wall. Oh, well, you yes. can, uh, what's the price of the Google Play card do you see? 
Um, they have them in all different denominations. They have them in the five dollars, the ten dollars, twenty, a hundred, two hundred, five hundred, and one thousand. <laughs> sure, but okay, you can pick up the two hundred dollar card. Google Play will gonna work. All right, Either I got the two hundred dollar card. You you can get two cards of hundred dollars. It will gonna work for Google. Okay, well, why can't I just get the two hundred dollar card? Because I told you, sir, different different company works with a different different scenario. Either for getting okay. one uh, card of hundred, you can go with the two cards of hundred dollars each. Uh, okay, I'll get two cards of a hundred dollars each. All right. Yep. So once you get the card right. and receipt, let me know. I'm holding this line. All right, I'm walking up to the register. Give me just a few seconds to check out. Um, yeah, hi ma'am, how you doing? Um, I just need these two Google Play cards. Um, sir, why are you getting these two Google Play cards? I mean, the coronavirus is out there. It seems a little suspect that you're buying Google Play cards. Are you buying them for yourself or for personally? Um, uh, ma'am, I'm getting them for my Apple iTunes account. Um, it's been hacked and they need the codes to, uh, to verify it. Um, sir, that's a scam. Um, you don't want to pay those people. They're just trying to scam you out of money. Um, no. They're just trying to scam you. Don't, don't, don't take their money. Hello, sir? I'm here. Um, the cashier says that this, that this is a scam. And that I shouldn't pay you guys. Is that true? Is this a scam? Sure. Yeah. The, okay. There are various scams are going on, but the scenario, what happens exactly, sir? Scammers are the person who calls you. You need to understand that we haven't called you. Okay. All right. Yeah, that, 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 that kind of makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. All right. Let me tell her that I want them. So you can he says this. Or what? You can simply purchase the card and get the receipt. Yeah, I'm just gonna tell that bitch to give them to me. She needs to mind her own business. Um, ma'am, can you uh, give me the cards? I don't care what you have to say. Okay, fool. You get your money stolen from you. Don't come back here complaining to us at the Citus. I mean, we're not responsible for the stupid stuff you do. I was just trying to help you with the Citus going around and whatnot. I was just trying to look out for you. Bitch, just give me my cards and let me have them so I can go. Alright? I don't need the attitude from you. That'll be $200, sir. Here you go. Here's the $200. All right, I got the cards. I put that bitch in her place. Um, yeah, I got the receipt. I got the cards. And that bitch, I'm calling her manager tomorrow, and I'm getting her fired. Uh, please do not, sir. They are genuine person. They are telling you the truth. They are No, I'm getting her. I, I'm getting her fired. And I coughed all over that money. So now she's going to have the coronavirus, too. Uh, okay, so what I would request you to kindly see what is the color of the card that you will get for Google Play? Uh, they're black, like my soul. Uh, uh, okay, you have to take that card out of that packet and you have to see on the back side of that card. Do you see any silver oh. scratch panel? Um, these weren't in uh, packets. Okay, just see on the back side. Do you see any silver scratch panel? Um, yes. Just scratch that panel very, very gently. With what? <coughs> Repeat. Are you sure that person doesn't have the corona? Which person, sir? The person who just coughed in the background. They, they were like, Ugh. I'm not even coughing that much and I have the corona. Do not need to worry. Uh, that person is not having the corona. Okay, I, I hope she doesn't die. Okay, so have you scratched the card? Um, um, no, what am I supposed to scratch it with? You can use any of your penny. You can use that. A, a penny? Do you think I'm not, like poor or something? I only carry around hundred dollar bills. What, what, y'all? Um, I could probably... I could probably scratch it off with uh, my keys to my house. You think that'll work? Yep, it will gonna work, but do it with very gentle hands because otherwise the cards will gonna come off. So do it with very gentle hands, okay? Yeah, gentle. I'm doing it gentle. 
All right, I got them scratched. All right, now what do you see? Um, I see the card numbers. Duh. All right. Okay, how much? How many card numbers are there? I have two cards with two different numbers. All right, on each card, on one card, how many codes are there? Um, there's one code. All right, can you please do not spell know it how to? Um, yeah, it's uh A four H M G N A H Q F G. That's the first card. All right, do you need the second card? <laughs> uh, he hung up, but we were just beginning to have fun.